All right. Hello and welcome back to Lempo, this time for part two. I hope you enjoyed the first video and if you left any support on it, thank you very much for that. It does mean the world to me. Keep it up if you can, all right? But here we are. Welcome back to Lempo and welcome to a completely new area of the forest that I'm sure to get lost in. <laughs> I'm not really sure where to start though, although down here on the stump, I did find a note, I think a letter from maybe my grandfather that suggested, I think somewhere to the east? Somewhere over here, there was a nearby hideout. So maybe we should go in that direction. But then, you know, I can't, I can't ignore this. I can't ignore that. And I cannot ignore what seems to be a giant cube in the sky either. So let's take a look at this, shall we? Maybe let's start with the soul that seems to be dancing to the side of this temple. Maybe I can add you to the Tree of Souls. A messenger of Erebos? No, it cannot be. You're not yet like those who worship her. First to bend were our spears, and after that our knees, the once so mighty, turned into slaves. Now I alone speak for my people. In this eternal darkness, I'm cursed to keep our secrets forever. If it's your oikos you seek, our magic might help you. More, I cannot tell, for I'm cursed. And he's right about that, because I'm trying to click, and I'm not getting any more. Okay. Strange. Very strange. Okay, we've got some rather ancient looking pottery and helmets here. Yeah. And then, of course, it just gets stranger. <laughs> What's all this about? Let's see. Okay, this is the statue of Hellas, right? What have we got here? Oh boy, okay, there's five slots for something. Uh, maybe six if I've got to add something to your hand. And do you want your head back? Is it around here somewhere? I'm not seeing it. <laughs> what have we got here, though? This looks like a, a strange kind of prison cell. But it's not someone inside, it's something. It's another one of these snake basin things, right? <sighs> yeah, I want to charge my Serpent Stone at some point, so it would be nice if I could actually get inside. Is there a door around here? Well, there's something. Before summer, serpents gathered to hold their trials. They settled their affairs and planned for the summer. A serpent's trial stone was passed around. They bit their marks on it as a signature. And that's what I've got. That's what I inevitably want to charge up at some point. Can I not? And is that blood? These are spikes, right? Presumably these came out of the ground and, well, I guess impaled people on them. Man. I'm not seeing a door. Right. Okay. Uh, oh, there's a mushroom down there. There you go. I'll take that. Uh, I'm just looking at my lantern, to be honest. Um, oh, you know what? I'm going to eat a mushroom, and I'm going to replace the battery. There you go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Is there anything else? Ah, yes. There's this that I noticed after I finished recording last time. You see the glow around the outside of the screen? Check this out. It's a hidden message. There's a three on it. Three what? I'm not sure. Although, to be honest, I think I've seen a couple of these things. Yeah. We can pick them up as well. There must be a reason for that. So I'm actually wondering if there's three of these things around here. Look at that balance. <laughs> I think I actually saw one around here too. Am I mistaken? Oh no, no, no. There it is. There it is. Okay. Is there another one? Right, there might be another one. Presumably somewhere nearby. It's not down there, because that's where I came from. Hmm. Let's see. So yeah, there's various ways we can go. We can go over there, we can go down that way, we might be able to go up here. And what's going on here? Fallen prey to the teeth of time. Here shall stay as filth and grime. Thanks! <laughs> That's not really helping, though. There's got to be another one, right? There has to be. Hmm. Okay. Wait, what was that? Did I just see some text? Oh, wow, look at that. Ten soul residue to regain your strength. Ooh, okay. Well, I've only got six, so I can't do that. But, right, okay. But check this out. There you go. There's number three. 
Am I right about this? I hope so. Okay. Ah, that's how you lower the spikes. That's how you get inside. So that was some sort of weird pressure plate? Strange. Very, very strange. But now we've got access to this basin. Yeah, I, uh, I don't need to use it right now, but maybe later on. Okay. <laughs> Are we done? Uh, I think we might be done. So, yeah, let's, let's head in this direction. Let's head east and let's see if we can find this hideout, right? So there is an opening. It's going to lead to something else. We've got shields here. We've got spears. These things. <laughs> Are they eyes? I very much feel like this place is out of time. And we're getting, you know, various people from various cultures here. Hang on. How's this? Is that a shield or something? A helmet? Huh. Okay. Right. Over here then? I mean, this this is east. Okay. The graveyard of trees. Okay. Bloody hell. Right. What we got here then? It's not only trees that have their final resting place here. The graveyard of trees is, after all, a graveyard of so many things. Tread carefully, if at all. Alright. At this point, I'd love to have a look at the map, but I've got a map of the previous area. Are we going to get a new one? Because this one is useless. I don't think we're going back. <sighs> Let's hope we get a new one at some point. So down here? Right. Okay. Looks like a big swamp, doesn't it? From what little I can see, anyway. Right. Oh god. Whoa! 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 whoa. Be yep. The bell dinged for a reason. Holy shit! Right. Where is it? Oh god. Is that the thing that I saw on that photograph? I think so, right. Okay. There's something over there. Right, is this is this worth it? Is this the Ooh. Oh, it's moving, it's moving, okay. Is the hideout over here somewhere or do I have to cross the swamp? Oh, oh shit! Hold on! What was that? Was it the water? I think the water hurt me. Maybe that's why there's a sort of bridge across. Bloody hell. Okay, do we have to go this way? I don't know. <laughs> the hideout sounds pretty good, and yeah, that is my objective, but... I don't know. Oh, maybe this is it. Oh, okay. Uh, that's not my grandfather, is it? It's Dunstan. Please be careful, the eyes are always watching. Okay. I can't leave while they're watching. Are always watching, right? Oh, ah, we can use this. Okay, did that do anything? The eyes are always watching. Okay, oh, there's another one. These? Oh, that's what we saw embedded in the ground, right? Yeah, okay. All right. Oh. Oh, look at this. They've been severed. Ah, okay, so that might have had something to do with it. What about this one? Oh, okay, that, that turns that one. I should probably try to release the poor soul. Yeah, yeah, okay, all right. Uh, something like this, I assume. All right. Did that one move as well? They're both moving. This one's not, though. There is another one here. Still nothing. Right, well, I haven't achieved much, have I? Okay, this one affects that one as well. Right, so... It seems like there was only one connection to this thing, and it's going over here to the one that's broken, so I, I don't really understand how we're going to move this one. The other two, maybe we could get them to turn away. There we go. Something like that. 
Okay, that one's gone green. Is that what we're looking for? Maybe that's what we're looking for. Should I try to talk to it? What, the eye? Can I? Or do you mean Dunstan in here? I've already tried talking to him. Hmm. Right. So this one as well. So this one turns that one twice, but that one once by the looks of it. There is going to be a sweet spot, I suppose. Right. Now that one's gone green. I think it's green, but you're still the problem. Wait, 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 wait. Ah, uh, where was it? Where was it? Here? It's not for an eye, is it? Oh, I think it might be. I think it might be. I can cover the eye that way. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. Right, now we just need to sort out the other two. Okay. I think we're aiming for green, ideally. And I think... Yeah, it is only now these two that we need to worry about. Oh! Hey! There we go! Alright! You're free, buddy! You freed me! Thank you so much! I lit up the flames in the swamp. Stay close to the fires if you want to cross it safely. Right, okay. Let's have a look. Oh yeah, so you did. Oh wow, this is a very, very big area. Right, so... <laughs> I'm safe down there. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Anything else? I think I'll wait here for a while before leaving. Just in case. Okay. So, you don't want to join Elizabeth in my pocket? No? Guess not. Alright, fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, should we try this again? Because I think somewhere down here we are going to find this hideout. Right. Oh. There it is. That is definitely the thing that I saw on that Polaroid photograph. Right, I like this symbol. So I just have to stay within the ring? Okay, right. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Ooh. Okay, alright, alright, alright. I think... I think I'm okay! Oh, 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 oh! Oh, he's angry. Oh, yeah, he does not like that at all. Bloody hell. Okay. Where are we... Where are we trying to go here, exactly? I mean, east is in this direction, so over to that fire there. That one. There's something over there. It looks like another temple. I don't know. Hold on. Right, so, tap R, jump. There we go, there we go. Look at this, look at this. Ooh, oh, hey! Yes, yes! Ooh. That was a nice little shortcut, I think. Alright. Go away, would you? You can't touch me when I'm here. Alright? You're an ugly looking thing. All the monsters are ugly looking things. Right. We're getting closer to that. Are we heading in the right direction? I think there might be another sort of temple building over there. I think there's another fire. It's a long way away. Is that soul residue? I'd... Yeah, I'd like it, honestly, but... Right. Okay, I'm going for it. Around here. Uh-huh. Oh boy. Oh, jump, 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 jump! Whoa, 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 whoa! I know where I am, game! Believe me! I just hope I don't add my grave down here. Oh man. Right. What is this place? This might not be the hideout. This might be something else. Could you go away, please? Oh, right. He's definitely trying to keep me away. But I don't I don't really know where else I'm gonna go. Unless I have to go back on myself. I'd rather not do that though. That's a long way. Look, I'm vulnerable. I'm out here. And he's still angry. <laughs> the bell's a little bit late, I think, but right. Maybe I should go the other way. 
Right, I'm going over. Okay. I'm going back here. Okay. He's still over there. He's still angry. He didn't seem to be too bothered with that, though. So, yeah, maybe this is actually my chance to go elsewhere. I... Oh, boy. I had to go and open my big mouth, didn't I? Is he trying to destroy the bridges that I'm using? I'm not sure. Jeez. I, I think he's just angry, honestly. Right, okay. You don't want me to go right, obviously, so maybe I should go over there. It's still technically east. Although now he's over there, maybe. Right, okay, let's try this again. Okay. Come on. Ooh. Go, 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 go. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. Holy crap. What the hell is that? Or who the hell is that? It's not you making that sound, is it? You're in so much chanting. Right. Okay. Ah. Huh. There's a ladder there. Right. I think we've got to get it... I think we've got to make our way to the ladder. Right, I I need you to go away, because I need to leave this circle. Right, yeah, I, I think he knows exactly where I am, and I think he's just waiting. I don't blame him, I'd probably do the same thing. That's really quite worrying, honestly. Okay, he's over there. Let's see. Okay. Ah! No, 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 no! Oh, bloody hell! <sighs> okay, right. Uh, I don't think we're meant to descend into the swamp. No. Oh, bloody hell. We are, however, meant to heal. There we go. That was really good. Is that like a full heal, that charge? Definitely worth it. Okay. Right. There's something over there. Is that a sword? Right, you're going over there. Have I got have I got time to investigate? Okay. Oh, it's a lever. It's a lever. <laughs> there wasn't a circle of protection over there. Oh man. Right. Ah, that's the lad that's more like it. Right, so yeah, we're not descending into the swamp, we're actually trying to ascend out of it. Okay, and now I think it's time for our ascension, don't you? Okay. Oh, climb faster. Climb faster, <laughs> please. Oh boy, it can't climb, can it? Oh god, okay. <sighs> Holy crap. Let's hope this is the right way and it wasn't down there. <sighs> Chances are I'll have to go everywhere around here. Let's see. Okay. Okay, there's another one of these wells, another sort of map area, I guess. Yeah, there's the cube. Let's use it. Let's save. Blimey. <laughs> so, we're east of the Graveyard of Trees. Are we any closer to the hideout? Looks like there's a cave there. Okay, and there's more... Right, is that... Is that more spikes I see in the background? I think it is, isn't it? Oh, alright. Is it the same thing? It is, yeah. Right, okay, so there's just gonna be there's gonna be various serpent basins around here, all protected. What's down here? Okay. Some steps. Alright. Usually get these things. You don't, however, usually get soul residue. Someone died right here. That's their blood, presumably. Oh, it's another lighter! Oh, brilliant! A tombstone lighter! Let's try that. 
Oh, there you go. I think that must be my favourite so far. Right, let's see. You got anything for me? Nope. All right. <laughs> Maybe later. No door this time? No, all right. Up we go. Okay, so we've got more spikes here. Does that mean there's also another, you know, weird platform thing? There it is. Right, okay, so let's see. Two. Right, so there's there's two cubes around here? Are we looking for cubes again? Every being has a thing that makes them complete. Their essence. And every essence can be lost. Without their core, they easily fall under Lempo's spell. I see. Right. Is there something over there that I saw? Maybe it was just a firefly or something. Right, okay. Obviously I want to go in there, but... I'm now looking for any more cubes. It might not be cubes this time. It might be something else. I'm not sure. Oh, no, wait, no. Here we go, here we go. Right. So there's going to be one more, I think. Just one more. Ah, there it is. Wasn't too far away at all. Took me long enough to find it. Bloody hell. Okay, number two. So again, the spikes recede and I've got access to that thing. Fantastic. Okay. Right, so there's actually a, another well down here. Let's see. Wow, okay, this one goes a long, long way. Please don't tell me that this lad is going to snap. I don't want to be stuck down here. I've still got so much yet to explore. There's that cave. Right. What the fuck? Alright, I don't know how I feel about this, honestly. Now, you know what? Let's keep that on. I've got this flashlight. This should be enough. Okay. Holy shit. Uh, are they skeletons? There's bodies down there? Right, yeah, maybe not. Although, when in Rome... <laughs> when in San Pietro, I suppose. Uh, yeah. What the hell? How far does this go? We're heading northwest right about now. Uh, I, I've got such mixed feelings about this. Where's this gonna take me? Is it gonna, is it gonna take me into danger? I guess we're under the swamp right now. We're under the, the graveyard of trees. Somewhere under there anyway. I guess, well, there's probably gonna be another opening. Maybe there's gonna be a way out. Okay, hang on, I can, I can, I can see the cavern. Alright. There's a door? Oh, there's a door. Oh, alright. Okay. Hold on. I might know where we are. Wait, is this where we came into this area? I think it might be, to be honest. We might be back where we started. If that's the case, that's actually pretty good. That means we don't have to traverse the swamp all the time. We can go underneath it. Yeah, this is it, isn't it? Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that's brilliant. Okay. Right, well, I don't really want to be here, so I want to go back. <laughs> Blimey, that took some doing. But it's a lot easier going that way than crossing the swamp. Is this the cave grandfather mentioned in his letter? It might be, it might be. So, <laughs> out of one hole, into another, right? Oh, okay. Yeah, is this it? Is this the hideout? Please tell me it is. Ooh, it's quite pretty, whatever it is. Oh, and it's got the right symbols. Wow, okay. What's this? Well, this is Grandfather's Cave. And it looks like Grandfather's got something kept locked away. No idea. Absolutely no idea. I'll have to come back to that a little bit later on. Right. Okay, more soul residue? Hopefully not my Grandfather's. Uh, yeah, hold on. <laughs> there we are. Dear Paul, I don't know if it's really you, but to be honest, I'm pretty sure. I've been trapped in this monstrosity for over a year now, and I've learned a lot. 
I think our family has some kind of a gene or something, a tendency to end up in here. My father never spoke about a place like this, but he once disappeared for a week and never told where he was. Could have been a wild man's adventure, but I think I know the truth now. This cave is safe, at least has been so far. You can use it to rest and gather your thoughts. These poor souls are friendly. I've met some that are a bit mischievous, but even they are pretty harmless. Just don't believe everything you see or hear. Have a healthy amount of skepticism and you'll be fine. Stay safe, your grandfather. It was still quite hard to believe that grandfather would have lived in a cave for ages and never mention it. Right. I had seen him just a couple of days before, so at least I knew that if it was true, then he got out. Right, okay. Looks like the old man really made this his home. I prefer this over the drafty tiny cabin. Yeah, me too, actually. What's this? A heavy lever. It's pretty big and looks old. There won't be many places where this fits. Okay. What we got here? My theory is that this place has layers, or floors of sorts. Closer to the surface is more peaceful, and the further you go down, the more dangerous it gets. There's an old church nearby, just over the iron bridge. I think they have a piece to the door there. Here is a lever to the bridge controls. Right. An old church. Bridge. Right, well I've got the lever. Somewhere to sleep as well. I'm actually curious about this. Ah! There you go. And a battery. Wonderful. That's it. Lovely. What about all these glowing rocks? Can't do anything with them. They just sort of illuminate the place. Something here? Ah, yes! Okay, it's another map. Another hand-drawn map. Let's see. Right, that's more like it. Okay, yeah, so... Yeah, bottom right, that's the graveyard of trees. We're on the... Well, we are at the bottom right cave, I suppose. There's a lot to explore in this area, certainly. Uh, right, yeah, okay, cool. Another battery? Wonderful. Um, anything else? Definitely, definitely. Okay, let's start over here. It makes me so sad, these mylings. Mummified babies. It's very hard to look at them, let alone move them around. They're so fragile and light. I feel like the entity doesn't quite know what to do with them. On many occasions I've witnessed strange phenomena around the mylings. Like, the entity's hold over me and the forest weakens somehow for just a second. I don't think there are enough to give proper protection against the entity, but I do believe that the mylings might help with my escape. I should try and find as many of them as I can. <laughs> Grandfather's collected dead babies, as any normal guy in his age does. Yes. Uh, so... Do we have to collect them too? Okay. I think the obelisk is what gives the cave's water its healing properties. The stone seems to emanate a kind of energy. It's soothing. I've seen another obelisk in the forest. It has different markings on it than this one. Maybe the makers of these things have left a message on them, but I've no idea what it means. There's an old hole on the ground near both of the obelisks. It looks like it's somehow a part of it, but the hole seems empty to me. Okay. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> It's clearly written by Grandfather. Backwards. Uh, okay, let's, let's see. The entity tries to imitate reality, but it clearly lacks the understanding of our world. There are so many things wrong here. Uh, I fear it will learn or interpret these messages, so I will need to hide them better in the future. Maybe I should use some kind of code, too. <sighs> uh, to escape, I think we need to go deeper. The, uh, the, the cave near the cabin was already a first gateway between levels. I believe the door in this cave is the next one. Okay. It seems to be missing some pieces, maybe finding them will uh, reveal a way to open it. Okay, bloody hell, that was hard to read. Please, no more like that, Grandfather. Right. Oh, there's the obelisk. And is that the door? What the hell is this place? 
Oh, okay, hang on. This is a place where I think I can find yet more soul residue. Right. Was Grandfather planning on burying that one? I don't know. Well, I don't know if that's a door, but that's certainly something. That's definitely the obelisk. Right, let's, let's go take a look. What about these waters? Healing properties? The water makes you feel better! So it does! Hey, that's not bad! That's not bad at all! I like this place! Yeah, this is much better than the cabin! <laughs> I felt an ancient energy from the obelisk in front of me. Somehow it felt safe to approach. Yeah, that's what you think. Okay. Right. Different symbols around it? Hmm. And are these souls traveling around? I guess so, right? Ah. Ah, okay. That kind of looks like it might have something to do with a key. I don't know, but I can use it. What about the others? Right, there's definitely some sort of combination here. Okay, so have we got to sort of figure out in what order they should go? Maybe we have to figure out where it starts and where it ends. I would actually say that that one is maybe where it ends. Maybe it starts as like an F, then it grows into a P. Or a normal looking P, like that. And then I don't know. Maybe this one? But then they're not on this one. Oh, that's it! An ancient vase! The pictures show a god enslaving people. Amazing. Oh, wow. What the hell have I just done? So that was the right combination, I guess. Well, <laughs> uh, I don't know if it was luck or judgment or whatever, but yeah, I, I, I figured it out. Okay, and there's another one of those in the forest somewhere. Uh, I see what looks like a well, and I can see the sort of temple area where I started, the eyes. There's a bridge to the north. Hmm. We need to, uh, we need to find that bridge. We need to recover our essence as well. Hello. He's losing his light. Please help him, Elia says. This guy? Alright. I can't talk to you anymore. Right, hold on, hold on. Dr. CJU is in the house. Uh, yeah, I suppose so. I've got ten. Yeah. There you go. Oh, you're just going to fly away? You're not even going to say thanks? Oh, right, so just going around the obelisk like all the others. Okay, do I get anything out of that? Oh, where have you gone? Ah. Alright, hold on, hold on. Back over here. What is this? Let's have a look. Okay, it's a weird note from Grandfather. Oh, I'm so happy. Fabulous! Everything's great here! I think I'm doing fine. I'm going to stay in this lovely forest forever. Who even needs a home? Life here is awesome, and festive, and supernatural, and magical, and just simply good. I would never have guessed, but the real world is actually just like a bad replica. Like, for example, days, and light, golden rays. Who actually truly likes daylight and seeing things properly? Darkness, dimness, has a perfect amount of vagueness. You can see rare things, but not the ugly details. I don't care for details, they're vain. Right, that was a weird note. Weirder than the one he wrote backwards. I've got to wonder how many of these notes are real as well, because I heard my wife's voice on the phone. I mean, it might not necessarily be him that's writing all of these. No suitable key in the inventory. Right, this must be the door. Okay. Okay. Is there something over there? Is that soul residue? I think it's just the light, actually. Okay. Ah, oh, that's where you ran off to. Right, okay. So, yeah, um, obelisks, the door, saving people, 
It's it's been an eventful journey. <laughs> but I think now we've got to go. I guess I guess we want to head north, really. We want to head sort of back over the swamp. We want to go to that bridge. But of course, I want to explore the forest. I want to get a little bit lost here. Right. Oh? My children are safe again, thanks to you. Oh, that was your child? They don't need my protection anymore. I cannot thank you enough. Take this relic. It'll help you get through that door. Oh, here we go. So this is the reward, is it? Oh. Oh, all right. Look at this. Wow, shiny. A golden chunk, a piece of something. It's huge, but lighter than it looks. Probably not real gold. And that gets added to the door, does it? Well, thank you. Right. Anything else? I didn't just kill you, did I? I... Oh, I've collected another soul! Elliot, right, okay! So, she's added to the, the Tree of Souls? Yeah, alright. From the Finnish parts of Karelia. Elia was a mother of four. During the Great Hunger Years in 1866 to 1868, she was left alone with her children after her husband left and never returned. Elia brought bread to the table by performing as an ikijia, uh, by performing as an ikia, uh, a kind of sorcerer who could speak to the dead. Through these performances, she and her offspring ended up inside the spell of Metzenpeto. Right, okay, so that's how she got there. And I got here from some sort of genetic link? There's something in the genes, my grandfather suggested? Right. Lucky us, I guess. Alright, so let's see. Can I use this golden chunk here? Okay. Wow, alright. We are, uh, we're gonna need a few more chunks. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna be, you know, two ears. It's not gonna be quite that simple this time. So that's what we're looking for. Golden chunks. Okay, alright. Should we get out of here then? Should we leave the cave? Should we explore a little bit more? I think we should. This game is about being lost in a forest, and to be honest, in this video, I haven't really gotten too lost in the forest yet. Alright. So... Nothing else? No, there was a, a litany of information here, really. But I think I found everything. Apart from the code to that, I'll have to come back a little bit later. Right. Thanks, Grandpa. I'm getting out of here. Okay, so what do we do? What do we do? I think we should probably stay on this side of the map to begin with. Now that we've crossed over this side of the swamp, let's just explore what's on this side before we head back. It was difficult to believe, but it started to make sense. Yeah? I was captured by an evil force, an ancient entity. It kept me there, or maybe it was that place. Either way, if Grandfather was right, in order to get back home, I first needed to traverse deeper into this world, into the core of it all. From there, I could hopefully break free. Right. Hopefully. Hopefully. Right, okay. The bell dinged, and I think it's because of these things. I think this is what we saw in that sort of underground lab, isn't it? Right, yeah, okay, so we should give them a wide berth, but not too wide, because they don't want to fall down there. There's no way. Way out. Oh, right. Okay. We we should probably get away. <laughs> I don't know where to go, but we should probably just yeah. Let's head let's head over here instead. What we got? Let's have a look. Okay. We can climb up here. Something down there, maybe. All right. Hold on. Can I get to that? Oh yes, yes I can. There we go. Okay. Is this somewhere to hide? I don't know. What am I doing this for? I'm gonna come down now, I think. Alright. Yeah, there's that ding. Hmm. Is there something? Okay, there is something over there. Is that soul residue? Right, that's all poison, isn't it? That's not good. What the hell's that thing? There's like some sort of spinning orb. Is that one of the eyes? Right, okay, let's give that a white berth too. Although I'm kind of curious. 
Right. I did see something... Right, let's see. Maybe this is going to give me another golden chunk. Who knows? All right. Ah. Okay. Um. Curious. I... Hmm. Can I jump and grab that? Oh, I can! Just about. Maybe I can sort of jump off the top of this thing. Okay. And then... There we go. There we go! Alright, so we're, we're pretty high now. What have we got here? Oh, it's a myling! An unwanted child killed by its mother can never truly rest. And it's here in the tree of all places. Right. Well, I guess that was worth it. Hmm. Down here. Right, I, uh, I would like some soul residue, to be honest. I'd like to avoid that thing if possible. It's just sort of patrolling the area. Right. This might hurt. Okay, five soul residue. Oh, it did hurt. Oh, wow, yeah, it did hurt. Five soul residue, though. That was worth it. Bloody hell, okay. Do I have a couple more mushrooms? I think I do. Oh, I've only got the one. Ah, I need to find some more. Are they around here as well? They should be, right? I was so good at foraging last time. Have I lost that skill? <laughs> okay, so we're still heading north to uh, what looks to be the edge of the valley here. Yeah, I don't know if there's going to be any more. And there's the swamp down there, of course. And the other temple, right. There's soul residue down there. But honestly, I, I don't know if it's worth it. Um, so that was the north. Let's maybe try the south next. Still staying on this side of the swamp, but uh, yeah, I think I saw some glowing green lights in the distance. I'm curious about those, honestly. Just got to navigate past these guys. Oh, okay, it's looking at me. That's not good. <laughs> uh, what did it say about them in that note that I read last time? Something about poison, like, don't eat them, basically. I wasn't planning to, but, um, yeah, that's just cemented that in my mind. Do not eat them. Right, yeah, what's going on here? There's definitely something going on. Alright. This is such a strange game. It's so unique, though. It's so different. I like it because of that. It doesn't feel like a normal horror game. Often it doesn't feel like a horror game. Often it feels more like an adventure game, honestly. But I'm still very, very much enjoying it. Alright, hold on. Okay, I, I don't know what you want to call these. They're not souls. They're like information orbs or something? Six nights was enough. Enough to wear out this being. So maybe we should say that six nights was too much. Okay. Well, let's hope I'm not here longer than six nights then. Right. We've got cubes, floating cubes. And of course there's that giant one in the sky, but right, okay. Hold up. There's another one of these things too. Aha, uh -huh, another battery. Always coming in handy. So hold on, I think the map's been updated, so yeah, we're right at the very south. Huh. Don't really know if there's anything else here. Let's have a look. Nothing seems to be glowing, so maybe not. But I'd kick myself if I, you know, missed something in the area. I haven't heard any dings or anything like that, so I guess there's no enemies. There is a leg, though. Okay. The void deepens. The fuck does that mean? Can I unclick that? Oh, but no, I, I, I don't want the void to deepen. I don't want the void to deepen, all right? Well, I, uh, hmm, yeah, okay. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing or a, a thing I should definitely have avoided. I think it's the latter, honestly. Jeez Louise, okay. Oh, here we go, here we go. At least there's a mushroom. <laughs> okay, right. Uh... 
I, I guess I found what I was looking for, and now the void's deepened, and and now I'm hearing more whispering. I do not like this. Could you stop speaking to me, please? Right. What have we got here? It's oh oh. It, it, <laughs> we're loading something. We're loading this lever. Let's see what it does. Oh, I can see what it does. I was gonna say, it kind of looked like a bridge on the map. Is it gonna act that way? I, <laughs> these aren't gonna fall, are they? As soon as I step on them. Okay. So far, so good. Again, it's, it's another way across the swamp. I could hear the dying tree crying for its lost friends. Right. And I stood without a voice forever. There's a body down there too. Oh. Oh, look who it is. Right, I cannot fall. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, okay. That was that was a tough one. All right. Okay. And over here. Uh-huh. All right. We're nearly to the other side. There's a ladder there by the looks of it. Okay. All right. We've made it to the other side and some more poison and those things by the looks of it. But hey, see you down there, and I can see one of those weird chests. Hmm. Right. I'm going to investigate. I might regret this. I, uh, yeah. I, I think I'm definitely going to regret this. Alright. Yep. I am not going down there. Absolutely not. Uh, maybe... Oh, hang on. Okay. Can I use this? Oh, yeah, okay. Alright, I'm giving it a spin. And I'm still spinning it. I don't know what this is doing. Right. Oh, I go too far away and I can't spin it anymore? Alright, hold on, hold on. It's that, isn't it? I'm pu I'm pulling the spikes up. This area is all about the spikes. So, I don't know if I want to be on the other side and imprison this guy here, or I need to protect myself so I can go down there. Probably the latter. Right, could you leave? Could you leave so I can take a look at that? Excuse me. Right, okay, he's not moving. He's not moving. He's being stubborn. That's okay. We can come back later. We can come back later. That's fine. <sighs> right. So, what have we got here? Apart from you. Whoa, please don't. <laughs> okay. Lovely cloud of poison you've got here. Uh, right, so... Yeah, we're, I guess we're just going to go along the sort of south wall. See what we bump into? Alright. There's a mushroom. There you go, there's a mushroom. Uh, to be honest, I think I might use it now. Yeah. Maybe two. There you go, back up to 93. Not too bad. Need to find more of them things. Nothing here? No? Hmm. Okay. There's an enemy, and... Ooh. Is that shell too? Right. Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay. What the hell? The tree roots are after me? You know what? Right. I'm just going to go down here. The rock seems interesting. This was just, you know, my guiding hand. Okay. Oh, underneath the rock. Ooh. Oh, wait. We got a secret here? Hmm. Okay. It was glowing for some reason. Ah. 
Just like these guys. Brilliant. Another battery. Okay. And something else too. An old flower lighter. And this has seen some years. Right. Yeah. We're getting all sorts of cultures, all sorts of time periods, all in here at the same time. <laughs> Very strange. There's definitely something up with this, right? Is it another number? Do I need to find another... another few cubes? There's one of those stone chest things east of here, down near the swamp. Still don't know how to open them. Hawk Claw. What a name. Hawk Claw. Right, well I've seen it. I just... I, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's an absolute bastard to get to without dying. Okay. Well, that's the uh, that's the secret hidden message that I was looking for. Oh man! Right, here we go again. Good thing I'm finding a few batteries because I'm going through them pretty damn quick. Right. There's a couple of mushrooms down here, and what seems to be some sort of enemy over there. So yeah, I think I'm going to give that a wide berth. All right. Can we go any further this way? Looks like we can, yeah. We can keep on going south. Okay. You are mine. Yeah, the uh, the void deepening certainly seems to have increased the, the frequency of these talks that we're having. He's trying to find me. I think he's uh, he's getting closer. Alright. Can I get up there? I don't know if I can. It might be a little bit too steep. Oh, I can. I can. But surely this is... Oh, yeah. There you go. This is the border. The return of this wall. A bit more interesting than an invisible barrier, I suppose. Alright, let's go back this way, then. Can I go up here? Maybe I can get a good view of the area. Or a view of an enemy. Oh, yeah. There's one there. Right. Here we are. Oh, here we are! Oh, oh, this is Obelisk Hill! I didn't see this on the map. Where the hell are we? We must we must be somewhere in that sort of southern forest, but I, I don't know where exactly. Uh, oh, there we go. Map updated. We, uh, we're there. Right, okay. Uh, a bit more west than I thought we were going to be, to be honest. Okay, alright. So there's blood. Is this marble? This is very strange. Okay, we've got shapes. There's a circle around here. Okay, an octagon. I, I think I, I got the combination right last time because, you know, I picked the right order. So is it like the corners or the sides? There we go. Two for two now. You feel refreshed. And out comes another one of these. Right. This time they're fighting a god. <laughs> I think I know where these go. I think I need to take them back to that statue of uh, Hellas, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's it. What we got here? Uh, Alice's burden, two out of five. Who's Alice? Okay. Noah insists that we have at least one more child. I'm exhausted, to be honest, but it's not like I have a say in this. And after all, my babies make me so happy. So I can't really complain. I love all of them from the bottom of my heart. Right. I haven't got one of those babies in my pocket, have I? Didn't turn into a myling, did it? Right. Oh, oh, okay, right, no, no. <laughs> so, we... Yeah, we uh, we go north from here, we'll hit this river. And if I follow the river back, that'll essentially take me back to the beginning, where I think I do actually want to go. There's also what looks like a... a well? Or something? Yeah. Want to have a look at that. But right, let's just keep... let's just keep exploring, shall we? Something down there. And maybe something here as well? Let's see. 
Oh, is it a candle? It's a candle. Just a candle. That isn't, though. I don't know what that is. Let's go and have a look. Maybe it's another information orb. Yeah, I think that's it. That's what it is. Okay. It is told that a powerful wizard lives in this forest. Some say he's not a wizard, but a god. And all say that he sings beautifully. Is that right? Oh, hey, look at this. Hey, look at that. Okay, right. Uh, I think we should probably stay away from the water, but don't tell me to stay away from the mushrooms. Right. Okay. What have we got here? What the hell have we got here? Oh, man. Wow. Are they, like, alligator gar or something? Like, the heads of them? I'm not really sure. Hang on. There's more over here, too. I don't know if they're fish. Are there lizard people here? I... <laughs> the hell is this? Hold on. Is that... Is the door it... wouldn't open. <laughs> by looking at it, it was clear that I couldn't squeeze through it anyway. I guess not. Is this where the wizard lives? Alright, hold on. Lempo takes the crooked handle, turns aside, the axe in falling, strikes the rocks and breaks to pieces. From the rocks, rebound the fragment, pierce the flesh of the magician, cut the knee of, uh, oh, uh, Wainamoinen? Lempo guides the sharpened hatchet, and the veins fell he severs. Quickly gushes forth a bloodstream, and the stream is crimson coloured. Is that right? Okay. Uh,. Y yeah, okay, um... I'm just gonna go this way. <laughs> Maybe we have to figure that out. Maybe we have to get inside. If you have any ideas, let me know down below in the comments, alright? Right now, I'm not sure, but maybe we have to sort of follow those instructions. I don't know. Okay, uh, so... We've saved. Uh, yeah. What next? So, I think essentially if I do follow the river, I'm going back to where I want to go. Maybe I should? Or maybe I should just keep on heading north towards the bridge. Let's go, let's go north towards the bridge. What's that over there? Well, that's north. Right, let's go around this thing and let's see. Right. I definitely saw... Oh, uh, yeah, I definitely saw something. What is it? I think it's more soul residue in the midst of all this poison. Ah, oh, there's another one of those orbs. Oh. Okay. Five soul residue. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh, oh. oh. Wow, I think I got got. Sacrifice a miling? Yeah? Am what? I dead? Is this heaven? Maybe? I, <laughs> I don't remember much of my first time in Limbo. Limbo? I think it was pretty empty and bright as hell. Oh, you're right about that. Holy moly. Uh, okay. What have we got here? Every death takes its toll here. You return as something less. And without your essence, you return only back to your prison. Which is why we need to find our essence, so we can escape this prison. What the hell? Okay. What's this? Oh, the bear? Oh! Okay. That's uh, Elijah's bear that I found right at the very beginning, on that bridge. Oh, bloody hell. Oh? Oh! Oh, the offering's me! Oh, okay! Oh, that's... <laughs> that's one way of dealing with it, I suppose! Uh, okay. Right, I know where I am. Actually, this is... this has actually been a nice shortcut back to where I wanted to go, I suppose. From here, I suppose, I could just go northwest and... Uh, and find the bridge that way. Yeah, okay. 
Wow. Yeah, don't let those orbs get anywhere close to you. Have I still got the, um... Okay, I've still got the soul residue. Hmm. Right. Okay. So, let's have a look. Let's see if I'm right. Yes, the ancient vases go here, I think. Okay. Maybe in a specific order? I don't know. They're different, aren't they? Presumably the other three will be as well. So maybe we have to tell a story. Right. Okay. Well, we need to find three more of those, and who knows how many more golden chunks. I do think we need to have a look at all these things on the map. And I, I do want to go to the bridge, obviously, but I'm curious. Um, this way? I suppose it would be this way, wouldn't it? Yeah, we're heading west here. If I head west, sort of around to the south, if I follow this around... Okay. Alright, not what I expected. Oh! Oh, that's a lot easier to find, isn't it? <laughs> Doesn't cost anything to open. Don't have to go through poison. Don't have to get killed. Did hear a ding, though. I don't know if it's another one of those orbs or... I don't know, the tree roots? Is that the obelisk that I'm looking at? I think that must be the obelisk. Right. Okay, so, can I go up here? There we are. Bit of a vantage point up here, I think. There we are. Wait, another one? Oh! Oh, wow, look at this! Oh, wow, okay, I am just loaded with soul residue right now. Is this a cable? Okay. <laughs> I just stumble into weird stuff in this forest. Where's this gonna go? Maybe this goes to that well. It takes me to a mushroom. So I'll take that. Okay, it goes underground. Where is it? Oh, here it is, here it is. Okay. Oh. <laughs> now that's a pretty big well. Okay. Uh, not actually what I thought it was going to be. Um... Right. It's it's a tower. Is that... I think that's the glow of soul residue. I know it when I see it now. It's overlooking the graveyard. Yeah, that's right. We must be... We must be there. Okay. Is there a way in? Please tell me there's a way in. Oh, there's a save point. And the map's been updated. Right, yeah. Why not? Why not? Just in case I get myself killed trying to get in. Who knows? Okay. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, well, there is perhaps a way up there. Hmm. Let's see. So far, so good. Alright. Uh, what did I say last time? You just gotta be brave, right? You just gotta be brave. Okay. I don't know if I'm brave enough to jump up there. No. <laughs> Over there, maybe. Uh oh. Ooh. Is this going to be a one-way trip? I hope not. Right, there's some soil residue. And there's some more. What on earth? Wait, there's a light down there. Is it to power the light? This is a very strange place. Oh, okay, hang on. There might be... Th there might be a TV down there. Hold on. <laughs> Maybe it's not for the light. Maybe it's for the TV. Okay. What the hell? Doesn't seem to be working. There's a horse down there. Is that meant to be the Trojan horse? You don't... Ha you, you don't have a tape. I'm meant to find a tape? How was I meant to know I was meant to find a tape? It's like someone's stolen the soul residue from here. Oh, man. Okay, so I need to come back with a tape? Right. Okay. Sure. Ah, there's a note. Okay. Oh, and this is Alice's burden number one. Okay. This baby will be my third child, and I think she will be the last. 
They're lovely and laughing and beautiful, but I feel like every birth consumes a part of me, and I never get it back. I don't think I have anything more to give, but I'm thankful for what I have gained in return. No regrets. No regrets. Okay, we need to find three more of those. Like there might be five vases. Maybe that's got something to do with the vases? I don't know, maybe it's the order? I... I don't know. I don't know a great deal. <laughs> that's what I'm discovering as I play this game. So, right, I, I started following this cable. Where does it stem from? That is now what I want to know. So, I, I guess we're just going to sort of go back on ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to go this way, we're going to go this way, and we're going to see where this takes us. Because it's got to take us somewhere. There's got to be, I don't know, a generator powering this or something? There's got to be something. Right. Yeah, let's just follow this yellow cable. It's quite easy to see, thankfully. Okay, it goes all the way to the other side. Uh, that's that's okay. That's all right. That's all right. I can I can just probably slip down here and meet you on the other side. Oh! 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 Okay. Right. Not great. Not great. Um, While well, I'm in the area. <laughs> Let's go sort out another charge. There you go. So there it is. Okay. And it's heading sort of northwest. Northwest of here. I mean, that's kind of where I want to go. Right. Let's see. Where are you? Up here somewhere. There's the cable. Come on. There it is. There it is. Okay, we're still following it. We're still following it. Uh, <laughs> okay, now it's in the trees. Can I see something down here as well? Oh, man. Okay. Is it worth it? I think I'm just going to get hurt, honestly. I don't know if it is. Alright, can I go along here? Okay. Uh-huh. All right. There it is, there it is. We're still following it. For me, the hardest thing in getting lost was being alone. Even uh -huh. after learning that I was actually in a real nightmare. And that I could die or never get out. All I could think of was my wife Miranda and our son Elijah. It's such a cliche, but being trapped made me incredibly aware of how empty my life would be without them. I was thankful and afraid as hell that I might not see them again. Ooh. I like how many of these are free to open here. Very nice indeed. Alright, there's another radio broadcast over there. Alright. How's this? Is this where the, the cable's stemming from? Right, is there is there a safe way down? There's something here. <laughs> Looks like it used to be an old aqueduct or something, an old bridge? I don't know. Right. F find a way inside the bunker. Well, uh, the bunker. There's a bunker? Alright. I was just going to say, that wasn't on the map, was it? But now it is. Okay, we're very close to the bridge. Right, so there's a bunker. Okay. I could see inside, but the hole in the wall was too small to squeeze through. I needed another way in. Right. Okay. There's something down there. Something over there, maybe? Oh. Okay, maybe. Right. What's that? Oh, boy. Are we gonna f Oh, I did see a trap door on the map, actually. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, it needs a key? I don't think any of these are going to work, are they? No. Okay. Uh, there is an arrow on the floor here. This direction? Right. It was something like you that killed me earlier. Never again. There we go. Another battery? 
Right. There's a walkway up here. All right. I'm looking around for more arrows. I think I've probably missed a few. I've probably jumped ahead a little bit. Is it something to do with this? Up. Up. Bloody hell! Well, that was violent. Here we go, though. Right. Thanks. This glowing rock's actually come in very, very handy, hasn't it? Okay. Something here? Return... Oh, it's the key. Return once used. We only have one copy. Rabbit. It's the bunker key. The key to the survivalist bunker. Okay. That looks like one of those monsters, like a decaying corpse of one of those monsters that I saw in the graveyard of trees. I think, to be honest, I was standing on one of them earlier as well. But right, the bunker. Let's... let's get out of this area. Let's go to the bunker, right? I guess it's gonna be that trap door that I saw. Somewhere over here. There it is, there it is, okay. Alright, let's try this one. Should work does. Hey, there we go. Oh man, we're going inside the bunker. We're going inside the bunker though with a fresh battery. There we go, much better. Maybe I shouldn't be using this though. It, there might be some more things to find. Hmm. Hello? Is anyone there? Sounds like it. Right. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Might not always feel like a horror game, but it certainly does now. This isn't a door, is it? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hello. Uh, that doesn't seem to work. No, I don't think so. Not right now. Wow. Ooh. Ooh. Somebody sawed off an arm. That's never good. Oh, hang on. There we go. That's another mushroom. I'll take that. Thank you. Anything else? Oh, wait. No, a tape. A VHS cassette. Surely that's what you mean. Caretaker? Alright. Well, I guess we can go back to the tower and watch Caretaker. We can't, unfortunately, take a proper flashlight. What the hell is that? I don't know. What the... Right, okay. It's a bridge. Or a pier, maybe. Oh, that's... That, that leads to the wizard's house, right? Ah. Okay. Alright. Ah, it's been loaded up with a battery. Brilliant. What about this one? No. Can we get this open? Oh, shit. Holy crap. Let's close that up. <laughs> wow, yeah. Okay, um, I actually want to put a couple of barrels and more sacks there, if possible. What the fuck? Okay. No, no, no. Alright. Oh, here we go. We've got a, uh... We've got a keypad here. It's gonna be another four-digit code. Ah, that's why it was glowing. Five, four, eight, nine... Four, eight, nine, five... Right, well, let's try these, I suppose. No. 4895. They're all using the same numbers, aren't they? So these are a list of possible combinations. I guess these will not work, but maybe we use something else. Maybe we try 4589. 4598. 5489 has been tried. 98. 
Nine, five, eight, four. Nine, five, four, eight. Open! Hey, there we go, there we go. Okay, so wait, is it this? It is. Ah. And is this the bunker itself? It is, isn't it? Right. Okay. So... Wait. Whoa. What the... Oh, shit. The hell am I hearing? Right. Is there a troll out there or something? <laughs> okay. All right. What do we got then? A couple of things. The, the bridge booth key. Key to the bridge booth. Okay, that's good. Another golden chunk too. Yeah. Uh, yeah, a piece of the door. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay. Exploration really is rewarded in this game. It's kind of the point, which is maybe why I like it so much. Right. Okay. That was alarming. Um, there might be... There might be a big creature outside, I don't know. Right. Let's see. Oh shit! It's escaped. Is that what I heard? It sounded much, much bigger than that. Right. Okay. <sighs> I think like last time, you make progress in the areas more monsters are added to uh, upset things, so... Yeah. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Alright. What do I do now? What do I do now? Because I'm in two minds. I, I kind of want to go to the bridge, it's very close, but I also want to go and see what's on this tape. Let's go see what's on the tape, shall we? Oh dear. Hopefully that's the orb and there's nothing else that I need to worry about. <laughs> okay. Okay, if I head sort of roughly in this direction, head sort of east, southeast, I'm gonna head back to that tower. And we're gonna find out what's on that tape. Caretaker, right? Alright. Here we are. Should be able to drop down there. There we go. A little bit of a shortcut. Okay. Let's hope this is worth it. Let's have a look at this caretaker tape. All right, in it goes. Good to go. All right, little little Lizzie is happy and safe, but how about if the darkness takes the place? Mummy's hand is not so near, and wow, Lizzie is about to bloat of fear. Fear not, little Lizzie. Caretaker is here to make your life more easy. Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> I, that's it? That is it, okay. It wasn't quite what I was hoping for, honestly. I don't know what I was hoping for. I guess maybe another golden chunk or another vase or something? Caretaker. Did we see that last time? Was that the thing that approached us by that weird rock when I got that second ear? Right, here we are again. The bunker. Not quite as bright as it used to be. I wonder why. I'm quite apprehensive, honestly. <laughs> Is there a troll around here? These green fires are usually okay, so maybe let's stay close to this. There's a red light as well. And what is that? Right. Pretty much directly ahead of me should be this bridge. I think that must be the iron bridge. What on earth is this? What era does this come from? Any notes? Any explanation? Nope. <laughs> what the... Okay, hang on. Is there somewhere else to save? Salvation's here? It's coming from this. What the hell? That's what he was saying. Salvation's here. Engine struggle and come to our church. 
Right. In your struggle and come to our church. It is a safe place for all. All you have to have is faith. We'll do the rest. And it's across the bridge, is it? Seeing the bridge for the first time felt unreal, to say the least. A large, dark metal structure just suspended in the air, like gravity was just a suggestion. <laughs> oh yeah, I see what you mean. Right. Oh, interesting, okay. Uh, this is presumably where I use that key, and maybe even the lever as well, right? The lever that I found in the cave a little earlier on. Is it around the other way? Ah, uh, okay, this, this might be it. Ah, yes, here we are. Surely this is where I use that key. There it is. Nice. Okay. Okay. <laughs> right, so have we got to work the controls? Oh, yeah, it looks like it. Um... But I don't know, was that good? One, two, three? Wait, do I want that on? I probably want that on. What's that? An ashtray, okay. <laughs> what about- ah, hang on. Oh, right, yeah, okay, so that's where the lever goes. And that extends the bridge connection, I guess? Or something? I don't know. Uh, there's no real instru- oh, hang on, wait, no, there is something here. There is something here. Instructions? Emergency instructions, great. The something bridge has a state-of-the-art fail-safe mechanism that prevents all possible damage caused by misuse or using it on the wall. Could be more clear, but maybe I can figure it out. I'd have an easier time of figuring it out if you didn't interrupt me. In a situation like this, the bridge will stop moving and sound the alarm. To return to the normal operating state, the bridge supervisor needs to enter the following override code after turning off all the switches. 7024. Here, right? Right. Okay. So, first is power. Second, I think, might be extending this thing? I don't know. Third is like turning the gear. That's the power, isn't it? Oh! Is that bad? That's probably bad, isn't it? Hold on, hold on. Right. Let's try that again. Okay, that's more like it. I've turned the alarm off. Right. If there is a troll roaming around the forest, he might know where I am. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, that's gone green now. Hold on, hold on. Now maybe let's pull this out. And then this. Oh, now that's more like it. I think we just had to wait a little bit longer. Right. Oh, here it comes. It's lowered. All right. Okay. So, do we go across the bridge? <laughs> I don't know. Are we really going to find salvation on the other side? Let's go and find out, shall we? This is safe, isn't it? <laughs> well, it seems about as safe as everything else in this forest, at least. Right. I can't really see the other side. It's like we're going into a void or something. Presumably there's something over here, though. Oh, yeah. Another area, I guess. Okay. So here we are at the other side of the bridge. What is this? Even though I was in the middle of it, living it, feeling everything concretely, it was hard to grasp the reality of my situation. <laughs> it felt unreal. I bet. It felt like I could so easily just give in die and then wake up in my own bed. I had to keep telling myself to be careful, so I would remember that it was indeed not a dream, and that I was actually fighting to stay alive. It's a bizarre thing to tell yourself, but I had to remember. I had to keep fighting. Right. 
What's that? Something down there. It's not a phone, though. I hear a phone. I see a phone. I see a phone box. What is this place? It's a castle, right? There's a castle on the other side of the bridge. I... Oh, okay. Hang on. What have we got here? Oh. A red lighter. Okay. Slightly rusted. Another choice, though. Okay. I have no idea where to begin yet again. Maybe we should climb up there? I don't know. Maybe we should go around the outskirts of the castle to begin with, though. I think that phone's gonna keep on ringing. I don't think we really necessarily need to go through that quickly. Something over here? Oh, okay, it's another one of these. Um, yeah, maybe... Maybe we should do this. Maybe we should save. Okay. Alright. Game saved. Fantastic. Right. I think this is where I'm going to call an end to this video and say thank you very much for watching part two of Lempo. I hope you've enjoyed it. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments, like or dislike the video. Let me know what you think about this game so far. Next time in part three, we'll explore this area, maybe find some more golden chunks, ancient vases, maybe even salvation. See you then. And then, of course, it just gets stranger. <laughs> What's all this about? We've got shields here, we've got spears. These things. <laughs> oh god. Whoa! 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 I know where I am, game. Believe me. How was that? Right, let's see. You got anything for me? Nope. All right. <laughs> Maybe later. I've got ten. Yeah. There you go. Oh. You're just going to fly away? You're not even going to say thanks? Either way, if Grandfather was right, in order to get back home, I first needed to try. The void deepens. The fuck does that mean? Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay. What the hell? The tree roots are after me? Okay. Five soul residue. Oh, jeez! Oh, oh, oh. Oh was pretty empty and bright as hell. Oh, you're right about that. Oh, here it is, here it is. Okay. Oh. <laughs> now that's a pretty big well. Bloody hell. Well, that was violent. Can I get this open? Oh, oh shit. So... What? Whoa. What the... Oh, shit. am I hearing?